Thousands of people descended on downtown Akron Saturday for the Akron Pride Festival. The day kicked off with the Equity March down Main Street with marchers carrying colorful signs and flags. The march ended at Lock 3, while Main Street was filled with over 200 vendors and booths. The festival was put on pause last year due to COVID, but it didn't deter the crowds this year. This was also the first year the festival took place downtown. It was previously hosted at Hardesty Park. The new location allowed for much larger crowds, more vendors, and more activities. There were three stages of entertainment, including local and national music acts and a drag show. Akron Mayor Dan Horgan was pleased with the turnout, especially after the newly completed Main Street renovation project. This is a phenomenal showing of, especially from where we came from, that this many people are down here supporting the community after we've done all of this to improve Main Street. I'm proud of the effort, not only from the committee, but from the community to come out and say, this is what we wanted to see. Thank you. This, thank you to everybody to be able to do that. Akron Pride Festival Finance Committee Chair Phil Montgomery spent countless hours helping organize the event. We've got a great team that works together. We are all volunteer, no one's paid, um, and we just work hard all year long to put on a good festival. We always are looking for people to volunteer. We have a volunteer website. for. Uh, there's a link on our website to sign up to volunteer. So we'll always take the help. The day ended with live music and fireworks at Lock 3.